What's up guys? In this video, we're going to break down a practice question about what it means when some of the ventilator alarms are sounding. Are you ready? Let's go! Before we get into the question, I just want to take a quick second to tell you about our Practice Questions Pro membership. How would you like to get new TMC practice questions like the ones in our videos sent to your inbox every single day? Well, the good news is now you can. Going through a new practice question every day may sound like a small thing, but over time, the knowledge that you'll gain will add up to huge results. So if you're interested in getting our premium practice questions delivered to your inbox on a daily basis, check out the link below at the top of the description. Now let's get into the practice question. You are called to assess a patient receiving volume control, mechanical ventilation, and you suddenly notice the simultaneous sounding of the high pressure and low volume alarms. What is the most likely cause of this problem? Is it A, there is a disconnection in the ventilator circuit, B, there is a leak in the ET tube cuff, C, there is a mucus plug in the ET tube, or D, the patient has developed pneumonia? The correct answer is C, there is a mucus plug in the ET tube. To get this one correct, you must have a basic understanding of ventilator modes and settings, which is why you should spend a lot of time on this section when preparing for the TMC exam. Since the patient is receiving volume control ventilation, a high pressure and low volume condition tells us that an obstruction is present. And when looking back through the answer choices, only one would cause an obstruction, and of course, that would be a mucus plug in the ET tube. A leak or disconnection would cause the low volume alarm to sound, but it would decrease the peak inspiratory pressure, which means that the high pressure alarm would not sound. And developing pneumonia would not cause any sudden alarms. So by using what we know about ventilator alarms, as well as the process of elimination, you know that the correct answer has to be C, there is a mucus plug in the ET tube. All right guys, that is it. Thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. Do me a favor, hit that thumbs up button, leave a comment below, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks again for watching, and I will see you in the next video. And as always, breathe easy, my friend. I'm not afraid of getting physical. All these different chemicals are fogging up my visuals. Bloods in my hands got slugs on my.